let's understand how we can attach a file to a record. So what we are going to do in this uh, scenario, so we will be creating a screen flow. In this, in this screen flow, a contact record will be created that will be related to an account. And after creation of contact, there will be a screen where uh, you can attach a file and that file will be attached to that newly created contact record. So if I take you uh, to the flow builder, so here you can see this contact creation flow is already available. If I open this screen, so here first name and last name, two text components are available on the flow screen. Then this create record element is available, which is mapping account ID lookup with record ID. This record ID uh, will be of the account and uh, first name screen component is mapping with first name field available on contact. Last name uh, is mapping with last name field available on the contact object, right? Now, additionally, what you need to do after creation of this contact record, you need to just have the newly created contact record ID because when you will be attaching your file with contact record, so you will need ID of that contact record. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to create a new resource as a variable and I'm naming it as contact ID. It will be of type text and done. So newly created contact record ID will be available in this contact ID. So after setting this uh, contact ID, you just need to click on done. So uh, that error was coming in my org, but uh, that was unusual. So I just uh, re-logged in and now this error is not coming. So this way, this contact create element is all set. So it will be receiving the contact ID after creation of contact record. Now, after this, I just need to add one more screen. So I'm labeling it as file upload and here I'm going to search for file upload component and I'm just dragging and dropping it. Okay, so this is API name. And here we need to provide the label. So that will be available here, right? So whatever label you want, so you can just uh, put it here. It will be available with your uh, upload file component. Now we need to relate this file with contact. So whenever you create a file, so file also creates a record. And uh, whenever we upload any file, so basically contained document object record is created. And that will be child for the record where we are attaching this file. So actually in this related record ID, we need to provide the parent record ID where this file will be attached. So that will be our contact ID, which we created right now. Okay, so here this contact ID is set, uh, that is related record ID. So uh, the file which you will be attaching, so it will be available on contact record automatically. Now I'm just clicking on save and activate. So jumping here, doing a refresh. So this flow is not available on this uh, record page. So I'm just going to place it. So from here, I'm just dragging and dropping it and I'm selecting create related contact on account, enabling this checkbox and saving this. Moving back, so you will see uh, the flow is available. 
So here, a contact will be created and then it will ask to upload a file. So let's say I'm creating contact as Sanjay1, Gupta1 and clicking on next. So now you can see, uh, right now contact is not visible here, but it is created. Now it is asking to upload a file. So I'm clicking on upload file and let's say I just uploaded this file. Clicking on done, finish. So here you can see uh, contact is created. And if I open this contact, so in the related list, you will see a file. So here you can see uh, in notes and attachment, this file is available, right? So this way, if you want to attach a file to newly created record through ScreenFlow, so you can do that way.